Very few of the Pharisees, the theologians of the time, believed in Jesus Christ. They were more interested in uh, the scriptures. And that is why Jesus said to them, You diligently search the scriptures in there to find eternal life, but you refuse to come to me to have life. Nothing has changed. The modern day theologians are exactly the same as the foolish Pharisees. The modern day theologians pride themselves in their knowledge of the scriptures. That is their treasure. Their treasure is not Jesus Christ. The other night, the Lord Jesus spoke to me. He gave me the name of a modern day theologian. I heard R.C. Sproul. I do not know this person. So I went on YouTube and listened to a few videos of this person and some of the renowned modern theologians that debate the scriptures and try to prove Jesus Christ and their faith from the scriptures. These people try to outwit each other by their knowledge and interpretation of the scriptures. But sadly, they have no knowledge of Jesus Christ because they do not know Jesus. Salvation is not about what you have in your head. It is about being a new creature because you are born again of the Spirit of God. When you hear the gospel of Jesus Christ and you believe and you obey Him, you obey His words, you repent and turn away from your own wicked ways and you turn to Jesus to obey and follow Him and you are baptized in water, then He makes you new inside. One of these Pharisees came to Jesus at night. We read in John chapter 3, Nicodemus came to Him. And Jesus said to him that unless you are born again, you cannot see the kingdom of God. You cannot enter the kingdom of God. These people debate and they pride themselves of their knowledge of the scriptures. And they think that they have eternal life. But they don't have Jesus because they do not have a testimony of Jesus Christ. They read, study and absorb the dead letter of the word. But they do not hear the Master Himself. They do not receive fresh manna from heaven. Jesus Christ is not living in them. They are bogged down, tied down and fenced in by their carnal understanding of the scriptures. And Jesus Christ does not fit into their limited understanding because they do not have the Holy Spirit. Many follow these foolish theologians in the hope of gaining wisdom, understanding and salvation from their theories and their teachings. But they don't have life in them because they don't have Jesus Christ in them. They debate the scriptures instead of following Jesus Christ. None of the disciples of Jesus went around explaining the scriptures. They preached the gospel of Jesus Christ and lives were transformed because those who believed and obeyed the gospel were changed by the power of God. The gospel of Jesus Christ produces a new creature. You cannot prove God or Jesus Christ from the Bible, but if you've met Jesus and you've been transformed by the Holy Spirit, if you've been born again, 
then you know Jesus for real. Then you are a new person. You are not a sinner anymore. You do not go to the same places. You do not have the same taste. You do not have the same outlook on life anymore. Because you have met the Master, you can see the kingdom of God. You are changed because the Spirit of God has transformed you, has made you new, a new creature. Unless you are made new by the Spirit of God, you cannot enter the kingdom of God. If you are born again, you are not a sinner anymore. Then you are a saint. You follow Jesus and you do the will of God. You listen to His voice. He guides you and He teaches you. You do not seek for inspiration from old dead scriptures. You seek your guidance and inspiration from Jesus Christ Himself. Because you know Him. And you follow Him. Do not follow after the foolish theologians who themselves, sadly, do not know Jesus Christ. Go after Jesus. Seek Him with all your heart. Invite Him into your life. Believe His words. Obey them. Obey the gospel of Jesus Christ. Repent. And turn away from your own senseless existence. And you will be transformed by the Spirit of God. If you obey Jesus, repent and be baptized, then He will transform you. He will give His Spirit in you to teach and guide you so that you can have understanding of the kingdom of God. And you will not need to listen to the foolish theologians who have no knowledge of God. They only have their own carnal insight of the scriptures, their own opinion, and their own carnal mind. Get your focus on Jesus. Seek Him with all your heart. Go after Him, and He will guide you into all truth. Because Jesus Christ Himself is the way and the life and the truth. His words are spirit and life. Listen to Him. Listen, and your soul will live. May Jesus bless you. Jesus Christ is alive, and hell is real. I am here to introduce you to Jesus Christ, so that you can know Him, and follow Him, and have eternal life. Subscribe to my channel to learn more about Jesus. May Jesus bless you.